Hello everyone, this is 3D Wrap's Logitech Shifter Mod, the Mod Cambio V3.5. What this thing does is it adds a 3D printed friction part as well as a plastic gated shifter kind of look, which should improve the overall feel of the shifter, making it way more stiff and notchy. Installation was very simple, but it was a little tricky to get it all together. If you follow their installation video carefully, you can see it's pretty simple. One thing I did not like was I had to remove my previously installed hook and loop along the sides, and since I had to remove it, the shifter now has that plastic clunk again, which is fine, it just makes a lot of noise. This right here is a sticker that's supposed to look like carbon fiber. Honestly, it doesn't look like carbon fiber, so for the extra few bucks, I would not recommend it. So how does it feel? Well, like pretty much every shifter on the market right now, it's not realistic, but it's way closer to a race car shifter than it was before. It definitely feels a lot better. Well, before I could use my pinky to do shifts, now I actually need to do a little muscle. Stock the shifter would need one pound of force, versus now it needs three pounds or maybe even a little more. It also has a very good clunk going into gear, just like a race shifter should be. One concern I would have with this is that now the gate is open, meaning dust and other stuff can make its way down into the shifter mechanism, whereas before it was sealed off with a boot. So if I ever need to clean this, I'll try and keep you guys posted on my Instagram or Twitter accounts. So, would I recommend this product? I think it all depends. First of all, the mechanism of this mod is definitely going to wear down, which is why they sell replacement parts for the wearing parts on their website. Now, I don't know how fast it will wear down, but when it does, I'll update you guys. Another thing is this mod is around $30, which, for a couple of 3D printed parts, I think is kind of too much. However, if you think that the cheapest shifter from SSH, that is, is $80, then maybe a simple $30 to get similar performance out of a Logitech shifter sounds more reasonable. So if you're planning on buying a new shifter soon, I would not recommend you buy this. But if you're going to keep your Logitech shifter for as long as possible, you should get this as it makes the feel a lot better. Now I would also like to add that I got 3D Wrap's brake mod and their sequential shifter or handbrake mods, and they also work really well. Personally, I won't be using them, as I like my brake as stiffness as stiffness can be, but if you just want a little progressiveness, then you should definitely check out their website, I'll have that linked below. Another thing I would definitely recommend is to get 3D Wrap's Logitech pedal to USB adapter if you have a G29 or G920. This thing will increase the resolution and it will more importantly remove the newer Logitech firmware, which adds a really high curve in the brake pedal. This adapter will make it completely linear so you can use a load cell or a stiffer spring and it will work the way it's supposed to. So thanks for watching my review and I'll see you guys later.